I am live at the Manhattan Temple and State Center with our members and friends who are visiting. And we asked for a visitor center, and they sent us up to the third floor. But, Sandy, what did you say when you, when you got locked in? You said, you feel like I'm home. I feel like I'm home. They're all the same. They're, they are, they're all familiar. They're all familiar. So the Manhattan Steak Center is, so they do allow us to walk around. Say hi, Sue. <laughs> they allow us to walk around and, um, look, at and look, look at the pictures. So I figured I'd just take you along with me. If you've ever been to the Manhattan Steak Center, we just took a picture of me with my temple recommend, which is I leave on the outside of my wallet. And um, in front of this temple was dedicated in front of the, the year you were baptized, right? Two years before. Two years before you were baptized. Yeah. So we just thought this would be a cool experience because the last time I was at this temple, they're having something going on. It looks like they're having what I would do because communication calling. Uh, so I'm going to be a little um, quiet. Last time I was here was a few days after I had my endowment. Anybody who doesn't know what an endowment is, that's when you receive your blessings as a full temple recommend holder within the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints. And it was on a Monday, so I wasn't able to enter, but we were able to walk around and use the bathroom. So if you ever need, if you're ever on 69th Street in Manhattan, and you're, it's very hard to find restrooms here, right? Yeah. Manhattan. Yes. So, yes, no, yes. So come to uh, the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, and you will have a comfortable place to use the bathroom. Yep. So let's see if we can see some pictures and answer some questions about the church. If anybody has, oh, speaking of restrooms now, there's the men's room. And there's the picture. Oh, let's see. What does the picture say, Sandy? What's it about? At the Manhattan Stake Center. Oh. Satan clear or Satan. Satan. Jesus clearing out the temple. Yeah. Because oh, they yeah. were selling and yeah. Yeah. Oh my friend from Oklahoma's on. Oh Dennis, sure miss your face. Happy to see you. You know, it was a year I was there um, yeah. this week. But I gotta I don't know, I feel prompted to tell you something. I was just texting somebody, um, there's a YouTube video that says Marie Osmond is currently in, on life support in the hospital. It's not true. I was just texting her assistant going, my gosh, you know, you can't make this stuff up. They're really after us. You know, they're really after people. So don't always believe everything you read online. Uh, my friend uh, K.I.R. says... I am so jealous. I served my mission in New York City. What year did you serve? That's There's awesome. Picture, so, show them the oh, so yeah, what it picture explains. They, they normally they have uh, signs underneath yeah, it. Yeah, but this is the baby. Oh, ba oh baby Jesus. Jesus. See, didn't Mary and Joseph my ears are, the temple? Yeah. My ears are still popping. We just came off a 97-story glass floor tour. So, um, yeah. So we have um, Kimber... Underscore says, hello, Dennis. I just made, I just made me endowment. I'm on the month ago, a month ago, with my aunt Colleen Lowe <gasps> in Chicago. I remember they flew out there. They flew out there to see you. That is so cool. And hello from Spain. Well, hello from New York City. Oh, that's the men's. Oh, that's the men's. You'll find the women's room. Okay. Um, yeah, there's one downstairs too you can use. Okay. So I actually happen to be losing my voice. Crystal, how are you? I have, um, I have a text from you I haven't gotten back to, but I've been a little busy. Sorry. Um, there's another picture of the Savior in the Garden of Gethsemane. Oh, the Garden of Gethsemane. Oh, and there's the DC Temple. Yeah. Which there is some great history about the Manhattan Temple, which is right in the same building we're in right now. Uh, the baptistries downstairs and the temples on the fourth floor, which it's a beautiful experience. Wow, I am losing my voice. <laughs> so, but I definitely wanted you to experience this. So let us know. Oh, here's the really good artwork that um, we have. And my friend Sue can explain. This is, he did bring... Mm. Glad tidings to Glad my soul. Ah, let me turn this around so you can see the temple this way. Or not the temple, I'm sorry. The pictures. The pictures. So, Sue, you want to explain this one? I'm not, I think it's just, 
any person because it's not a specific story. It's just telling you that Heavenly Father and angels can bring yeah. bad tidings to your soul. They can bring bad uh, tidings to us. Yeah. Karen says, actually have been to church there, first visited in the U.S. That's awesome. Just got back home last month, our friend K.I.R. says... Um, Kimber says, hello, Dennis. I made my Adam in a month. Oh, yeah, I was calling. Uh, that was endowment. I'm sorry. Autocorrect. Uh, K-R, K-I-R says, if you see any, you know, we've seen a lot of members. Oh, you have a, um, say hi from Sister K-R. Um, no, Spirit Siri, I totally get that, Kimber. It happens to me all the time. Elizabeth says, why aren't you, um, giving anyone devotionals. Um, I decided not to do devotionals with the church anymore, only because it's been exhausting. And it's a lot of work. And that's something that, um, you know, I will do them for special occasions based on... Um, let me turn this around here. This, I think, is depicting Alma... Alma baptizing in the water. Baptizing in the water, Mormon. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Mazo- 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 eighteen eight. eight. I yeah, that's right. Because it did. says come into the um, fold of God. Yeah, the fold. But so I yes I funny. I decided not to do based on the spirit not to do devotionals because it was just All it's a lot of work, of um, and everything in our yeah. church is a calling, and I, I, I yes my flights are paid for but nothing else so I it's just. I need to make a living, <laughs> um, which is why I'm focusing on YouTube a lot, which is why I save all my live videos up on YouTube. So let's hear this one, you guys. This is um, Alma 4620. Oh, it's Title of Liberty. Yeah. Yeah. When, when they were fighting the war, and he's like, this, this is why we're song? doing it. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're fighting for our liberty, our families. I can't remember what else, but... Um, they made a title of liberty to show what their purpose was. Oh, that it was that's righteous. great. Marion's daughter, it's incredible to be seen, and you uh, make my heart glow as well. So thank you for that comment. Um, we have one more comment too. That um, Joan underscore says, "So proud of you. You um, are you aunt? Well, I can't read that. What does it say? Is it autocorrect?" Um, proud of you, you, ain't your, you, are you aunt something something's grandson? Oh, um, they were asking, oh, you were asking one of my friends. So this is Joan underscore T-I-F-F underscore Willis. Um, so you were asking if somebody, one of my friends is somebody's grandson. So we'll see, jo- uh, Sister Joan. Um, just post again. So this picture is Alma 5727. Which is um, the stripling warriors mm. who um, their parents buried their weapons of war. And so when it was time to go to the war, um, their parents wouldn't, they, they wanted to unbury their weapons to protect their kids. But their kids, their son said, no, nope, mm. we will protect you. And at, I don't know, they were young men. And they went to war, and even though there were some wounded, none of them died. I should take these people with me everywhere. They, they, they're really knowledgeable with this. And then this one is... Um, um, I did raise my, my voice, voice that breached and preached into the heavens. Oh. And, it's, oh, it doesn't, where does it say it? Oh, it's sound? Enos. Is that Enos? E- Enos, Enos, yeah, Enos, Enos four. prayed all day and all night. Yep. Yeah. Um, be, and, and asked for forgiveness for him mm. and all his brothers. And, and he just, he prayed all day and all night and got his answers. That's great. <clears throat> um, so we have a comment from SHIV that says, I hope I get to meet you someday. Feel like I know you watching your lives. Aww. Uh-huh. I ditto. Uh, Marion's daughter says on a totally um, superficial note, your hair looks amazing. It's, oh my gosh, it's windblown. Yeah. And it's this new clay I'm trying, salt or whatever. Um, 
thank you for showing us these beautiful paintings. I'm glad you get to see them. Oh, Karen. When you're done, there's one over there. We here. love you. There was no temple yet when you attended church there. Wow. That was a long time ago. Um, oh, our friend S.A.M. says, Walter Rain is... Brilliant. Brilliant artist. Oh, you know the artist or know of the artist. Oh, yeah. Um, look, it even says it right there. Oh, it yeah. does. Oh, you are really it's on top really of it. Good. Look at that. I can zoom in on that. Great job. Wow, I'm impressed. We okay. didn't even know that. Here's one that he did about Jesus. Oh, Jesus. Because this is Jesus and Martha and Mary. Yeah. Because the one sister went to the preparing and, mm. and the other sat down to listen to Jesus. And Aww. the one sister was upset, but Jesus said, we basically, we each have our own roles and our yes. own yeah. things to do. Well, thank you for joining us live today as we tour... The uh, Church of Jesus Christ of Latter Day Saints in Manhattan. In Manhattan, we have hello from Russia is wow. on. Thank you, Russia, for joining us. We love our friends in Russia. Um, and then we have uh, this is J J O H H N underscore S A N. Um, so oh, it says I waved. Hi, sir. Okay, thank you very much. Um, and then. Oh, wait a minute. What's this? Uh, Glad Tithings is Helium. Helium. I always say Helium. Helium 13.7. Okay. Yeah. I realized that after. They are, they, are, they are in the Book of Mormon paintings. This yeah. is no special. This is so special. This is no special to see. Thank you so for showing us. I think mm -hmm. she meant so. Yeah, no, I get it. All right, so our friend, uh, we're going to, his name is John. Dasser, he's asking for prayers, okay, okay. and we're going to keep you in our prayers, my friend. You got it. From BYU Regards, he says. Uh -huh. um, oh, he loves it. And thank you for the badge, our friend B-W-I-L-S. Um, that means a lot. Really, um, he says, hey, Dennis, thank you for sharing these lovely paintings. That's awesome. I'm glad. There's a lot of things I'm going to share to my stories later. We have done so much fun here. We have met other members that uh, we are doing a contest where we actually, um, oh, you said looking forward to conference this weekend. We are super excited yeah, for conference. Yeah. We cannot wait. I'm going to turn this around, ladies, sisters. So... Um, this is my friend Sandy. She literally picked me up off Instagram. No pun intended. <laughs> I did. Um, and that's her friend Sue right over there. Uh, we're neighbors. We're She's neighbors. And I. But and we adopted him. They did. And yes. they're here visiting. And we got to go see um, a play last night on Broadway, which is just Music. magical. It's a five star. Yes. Music Man is a five star. With Hugh, Man. I always mess with Dad. Hugh Hefner. <laughs> yeah, yeah I, said, I told my friends at church, I said, I'm going to see. Um, a play with Hugh Hefner from another member, and they said, you may want to check her membership status. <laughs> and I'm like, who's Hugh Hefner? It sounds familiar. It was Hugh Jackman. Hugh Hefner was not, anyway. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. So. And didn't they show us today where he, Hugh Jackson lived? Yes, I yes, we saw him. where he lived. So, um, well, I have, we have no comments, other comments, so I think, we, oh, we have one more painting down here we'll get to. We and then two. Oh, we have or two. Three. Okay. Oh, Sue is Look, knowledgeable with this. Sue, I'm going to turn this around. Missionary. Where's the missionary? I she was. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, wait a minute. Where did you serve? I'm like, oh, I turned. I wonder, wait, where did you no, serve? Let's stop for a second. Oh, where Texas. Um, I was called to the Texas San Antonio mission. Why I was there, it was split. So I came home from the Texas Houston mission. I love and it. If you can't tell, it's been a long time <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't matter you look fabulous mission. you have natural highlights as soon as you said mission i'm like where where i almost got whiplash <laughs> okay so, so tell us about this sue here i, I don't know mosiah twenty seven twenty. Oh yeah oh oh it's his, gotta be alma right alma, yeah when um he was out and he got struck dumb because he was trying to pull people you said out. down not dumb right so, Yes. Okay. Yeah, yeah, but struck down meant. Yeah. I can't do anything, but down is yeah. more appropriate. Yeah. Um, okay. And then the sons of Mosiah were with him. They were all preaching against the church, and his father was praying that they would be rescued. And so it says on the bottom, his father rejoiced, 
because he knew that his prayers had been answered when they brought his son home in this condition, knowing because these guys said, we saw angels. And they then were converted and started doing missionary mm. work instead of fighting against fighting. the church. Yeah, doing, that's what you need is we need more missionaries. Yeah. Yes. And so, um, because actually, you're a convert to the church. I am. And she was baptized. Two two of O two. Two two of O two. That's awesome. Yep. And you were born into the church. No, no. I am also oh. a convert to the church. Really? But I was eleven when we were converted and turned twelve. When you got baptized in November and turned twelve in January, but That's there were awesome. no missionaries because we were on the island of Guam. So it's wow. good members of the church. Who taught us about the gospel? This and is a we great got story. On Guam. If we awesome. only had a hotel room, we should do a live with this yeah. well, story. <laughs> and then on the way home, we'd been members of the church long enough that we were sealed in the Hawaiian temple on the way home as a family. I love it. That was awesome. That's a great story, Sue. <laughs> That's a great story. So let's talk about this one first. I don't want to make people dizzy. Okay. Oh, and right here is the chapel. And we're not going to go in there because it's yeah. sacred. But um, And we're on the third floor in Manhattan of the Stake Center. And above us on the fourth floor is the temple. So this is 3rd Nephi 11.15. So it's when Jesus appeared to the Nephites. And he blessed them on the bottom. It says one by, by one. one. I like he that. He blessed each of them. So remember, he will bless us one by one. What you need, yep. you will receive. Receive. If you live righteously and pray. This just totally took a whole new turn. I, I forgot you were baptized in Guam because of member missionaries. Yep. <gasps> love, love, love Alma that. I can't wait for conference. Oh, this is... Um, Alma 1910. Yeah, this is when the king um, passed out or fell dead and his wife thought he was dead. But um, it was just because he'd been converted. And I think why he was dead. But I'm adding my own commentary that That's okay. he was repenting. None of us are perfect. Yeah. He was repenting. Yeah. And then he came back alive and told yeah. his people, hey. And he, he even had to fight with his father. And his father finally it's, said, okay. I love to be corrected if it's, correct, if it's corrective criticism. Right. If it's correcting because somebody's trying to say... You don't know what you're doing or whatever, or it's an anti-member or somebody who's against us. That's not good. So um, there's, one more. there's one more here. But before I go there, I just want to show. So these are the elevators up here. And then over here are the missionary plaques serving. Aren't they the cutest? They're so nice. We have um, a missionary serving in, in uh, Missouri, St. Louis Mission. We have California, San Diego Mission. And we have another one here serving in Seattle, Washington. That is awesome. And there's the, the chapel in there. And oh, they're having an interface. See, I heard the communications. When they were talking about when they were talking about communications, that's what I do. I'm I'm in the state communications. So I immediately left because the spirit told me let's walk away from where we were because I didn't want to interfere with but that. But the names have interface they're, they're and New York. Interface. Oh, yeah. International community. The Jewish New, community. Yeah, New York um, Board of Rabbis. Oh, the New York Yoga community. That's oh. awesome. We love interfaith. That we really do. Awesome. So if you're not a member of the Church of Jesus Christ of Latter-day Saints, please know that we love all religions. And we're just happy and that you're going to people. church. And all people. That is so important. All people. And this one's that ye might yeah. be believed on his name. This is healing and preaching mm. to people. Yeah. Tell them, hey. Hey, hey listen. listen to me. I know. I'll never forget going live with Colleen. On, and I said, let's do the beginning of Heal You. She goes, oh, we'll never do that again. People are so depressing. People. Yeah. So we have our friend Sam says, um, the music man is a fun show. My mom loved seeing that show too. Marion's daughter says dying emojis. I just love that uh -huh. I'm not the only one who gets names all mixed up. Hugh Hefner, <laughs> Hugh Jackman, it's all the same. The Eiffel yeah. Tower. <laughs> Eiffel yeah, she, uh, she told her husband that she was seeing the Eiffel Tower, but she meant to say 
she was seeing the, she went to the top of the Empire State Building and he's like, you went from Utah to Paris? <laughs> uh, our friend S-O-Z-A-M says, beautiful. I had never seen that picture before. Wow. I just love the miracles that unfold. Mm -hmm. Kimber underscore says, I'm a convert for over a year now. Well, welcome to the family. You are with 17 million members worldwide. Don't ever forget that when times get tough and don't ever underestimate the power of a priesthood blessing. They're amazing. SOZ says, thank you for giving me a reason to go to New York. Ah, oh, New York is fun. Beautiful. It really is. So I think we got all the comments. Mm -hmm. awesome. So down there is the interfaith hallway. And I think we'll just leave it at that and say thank you so much. And thank you to our friends. We just think all of you are awesome yes, and thank amazing. You. Thank and most you. importantly, so doesn't the Savior. Yep, we love you. That was we fun. We love you too. It was. Mm -hmm. All right. Thank you. Bye for now, everybody. And I'll upload this to YouTube in about a week or so, my YouTube channel. That was